From this evening, I must give the British people a very simple instruction. You must stay at home. Hello and welcome to day one of lockdown. On this episode, Millie. Millie here will be picking her lockdown personality. Four very different yet emotionally unstable personality types will be trying to convince you that they're the best personality for you to have for the entirety of this government enforced lockdown. Let's start with contestant number one. Contestant number one, please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm the motivated you. Listen, I've been thinking, and this whole pandemic thing really seems like a blessing in disguise. You could use this time to do something useful. If you pick me to be your personality, you'll come out of this lockdown fitter, more educated, and ten times the person you used to be. You'll read all these books. You'll learn Greek, French, and Spanish. And you'll write that novel you always meant to write. Wow, what a strong pitch from contestant number one. What are your thoughts? She's very intense. Um, I have a question. What happens if I don't achieve these things? Well, then I'll just fall into a deep void of depression because I'm worthless. Great, great. Great. Moving on to contestant two. Hi. I'm the slob you. If you pick me to be your personality, we're just going to ride this thing out by doing nothing. You'll only ever wear pyjamas, you'll never have to wear a bra, you'll eat peanut butter like yoghurt, and you'll just do nothing. Look, look at these mugs. You'll make the tea, you'll drink the tea, but then never take the mugs down to be washed. It's like a work of art. What exactly would I do with my day? You'll adopt the lifestyle of a very fat house cat. You'll just sleep 70% of the time and then the rest of the time you just watch Netflix. And what do you think? Could contestant 2 be the personality type for you? Um... Right, on to contestant 3. Hi, I'm the paranoid you. If you pick me to be your personality, you'll be checking the news four times an hour. And when you've exhausted all official sources of news, you'll move on to the unofficial stuff, which people like to call conspiracies, but I like to call alternative truths. You know what I think? I think this whole pandemic thing is just a marketing ploy to get people to buy Disney+. Plus. Think about it. Think about it. What, what are people doing all day? Just watching Disney films, huh? Yeah? It's genius. Moving on to our fourth and final contestant, who is joining us via Zoom. Hi, I'm your Zoom friend. If you pick me to be your personality, we'll get through this crisis by running quizzes, running D&D sessions, just generally being the queen of the virtual pub. And you'll do all this as an excuse to drink, because drinking alone is sad. But drinking with friends, even virtual friends, that's acceptable. And you'll do all this even though you've got terrible connection. Oh no, seems like we lost connection. Never mind. Show's nearly over, so it's time for you, Millie, to choose your lockdown personality type. I don't want to be any of these people. I'm afraid you're going to have to pick. Would you like to phone a friend? Yeah. Right, yes. I'm hearing from all your friends and family and everyone who's ever known you. And the results are in. Turns out, Millie, that your default personality is contestant number two. Millie, you've always been a slob. What? No, I'm not. Look at yourself in the mirror, Millie. You've been contestant number two this entire time. 